Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello everyone, my name is Virginia Ginta Fahrani You can call me Ginta and my last student number is 90 Today, in this occasion, I would like to present about my research article And the title is The Teacher and Student's Perspective on Online English Learning in the Pandemic Era So now we are going to the first slide Okay, the first slide is about table of contents of my research article. The first one is abstract, and the second one is introduction, and the third one is theoretical review, and next, the method of my research article, and next, the result and discussion of my research article, and the last one is the conclusion. So, now we are going to the first topic. Okay, the first topic is about abstract of my research article. This study aims to analyze how the perspective of teacher and students on online English learning in the pandemic era. The data collection technique in this study used the interview method which consists of 13 statements for the teacher and 5 questions for the students. This research is a qualitative descriptive study with the data analysis techniques used. The first one is data reduction, and the second one is data display, and the last one is conclusion and verification. Okay, now we are going to the second topic. The second topic is about introduction. The COVID-19 pandemic has caused change in the order of social life, especially in the world of education. According to UNESCO 2020, schools are closed in many countries due to a public health emergency because the government requires online learning. However, the application of online learning does not always run smoothly and effectively. Specifically, this study aims to find answer to the following research question. The first one is, how do you feel about online learning, especially in the English lesson? And the second one is, what are your obstacles during online learning? And the third one is, what is your perspective of online learning? Can online learning make it easier for students or does it make it difficult for students. Okay, now we are going to the next topic. The next topic is about theoretical review of my research quest or my research article. And the first and the first one is global perspective on online teaching and learning. The national lockdown for months has had a bad impact on students' learning progress. Students enjoy online learning when the right facilities are accessible to them. However, poor network and connectivity have proven to be a major obstacle for students. And the second one is online learning. According to Ono Wipurba 2002, online learning is one form of information technology that is applied in the field of education in the form of virtual schools. Okay, next. The definition of learning English. Learning English is what people do when they want to use English language. And the language skill in learning English includes speaking, listening, reading, and writing. Okay, next. Okay, there is the research method of my research article. The first one is research design. The design of this study was carried out using a qualitative approach. And the second one is participant. The participants in this study were an English teacher and five students, and the instrument and procedure of data collection. In this study, the instrument used was an interview. 
Okay, Max. Okay. There is the data analysis of my research article. The first one is data reduction. The researcher focused on teacher perspective of online English learning in the pandemic era. And the second one is data display. The researcher will present the data and simplify it by using the original text. Sorry. The researcher will present the data and simplify by using the original text in the form of narrative text. And the last one is conclusion and verification. The researcher concludes the main points from all the data that has been collected. Okay, now we are going to the next topic. The next topic is about result and discussion of my research article. The first one is the feeling of teacher and students about learning English online. The result of the interview data analysis showed that the teacher was used to online learning because at the beginning of the pandemic, she had introduced digital skills to students. While the students say that they were happy and not happy with online learning. And the second one is obstacles during online learning. According to the English teacher, she did not encounter any problems. However, there are obstacles from students such as difficult signals, the internet data that run out quickly, difficulty understanding the material and internet data subsidies from the government which run out which run out in the middle of the month. Okay, next. The teachers and students perspective of online learning. According to the perspective of the English teacher about online learning, if the instructions are clear from the teacher, it will be very easy with simple instruction notes. The material is relevant and then apply in everyday life. Meanwhile, according to the perspective of the students, they say that online learning can make it easier and can be difficult. So now we are going to the last topic. The last topic is about conclusion. Based on the result of the study, it can be concluded that the teacher is familiar with online learning. So that she does not find difficult to apply online English learning in the pandemic era. Meanwhile, students that that they were happy and not happy with online learning. In addition, the teacher does not encounter obstacles because students can communicate well. However, students experience various obstacles during online learning. Okay, I think that's enough about my presentation. Thank you for your great attention. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. See you.